Let's graph the linear equation for y equals 1 half x plus 2. And we're going to do this two ways. First, we'll put in values for x, find the values for y, and then we'll plot those points on the graph here. Next, we'll check our work with the slope-intercept formula. So let's put some values in. We want to use values that we expect will show up here on our graph paper, won't be out here on the sides. Let's start with 1x. So if we put 1 in for x, 1 half times 1, that's 1 half plus 2. We have 2 and a half here. If we put 0 in, 1 half times 0, that's 0. So we have just 2. And then let's put negative 1. If we have negative 1, 1 half times negative 1, that's negative 1 half plus 2. We have 1 and 1 half. So these are the points we'll graph for the equation y equals 1 half x plus 2. So let's see, we have x is 1, y is 2 and a half. So x is 1, we go 1, 2 and a half. That's our first point. x is 0, y is 2, 0 and 2. And then finally, we have x is negative 1, y is 1 and a half. So negative 1, 1 and a half. And you can see there's our line for this equation, y equals 1 half x plus 2. Let's put a line through this. And then we'll put some arrows to show that this goes into infinity. And that's the graph of our equation. We could have used just two points here. It's nice to have three in case you make a mistake. Let's check our work with the slope-intercept formula. So we have y equals mx plus b. b is the y-intercept. That's 2. So we'll find 2 for y, and that's where the line should intercept this y-axis. And right there it is. Same as the other point. And that kind of makes sense. Once we've got this y-intercept, we look at the slope. It's 1 over 2. That's rise over run. So we can go to our y-intercept, and we're going to rise 1 and go over 2. Let's do that again. Rise 1 and go over 2. And we can keep doing that. Rise 1 and go over 2. All those points are on the line. Likewise, go back to our y-intercept right here at 2. Go down 1 and go over 2. We can go down 1 and over 2. Those points are on the line as well. So we have the correct graph here for this linear equation, y equals 1 half x plus 2. We could keep putting values in for x and finding the values for y. They would all be on this line here. This is Dr. B with the linear equation, the graph for the linear equation of y equals 1 half x plus 2. Thanks for watching.